Oh boy, Greenleaf fan. I mean, aside from the young man at the gravestone, a lot of people have been bringing up Carissa to me um, on Instagram and the YouTube comment section. And I, I mean, it's hard to even put into words what to say in this video. I think the real question is, aside from, you know, the mystery of what exactly happened with the Will situation with a Mrs. Davis versus Bishop to get the house, I'm still thinking Mac had something to do with that. My mom did too. I talked with several people about this and a lot of people think that it was probably foul play with Mac that led to what occurred to uh, the AKA missing original will, the current will, and how Bishop and May got the house. I'm wondering if Carissa is going to use this as blackmail, so to speak, in order to get what she wants. I mean... If she spills the beans, then apparently Bishop will go to prison. And I'm pretty sure the green leaves don't want that to happen. So what exactly will she do? What exactly does she want? I mean, aside from the chlamydia she already has. But I'm thinking that when it comes down to it, do you think that even though Jacob wants to divorce, which I'm pretty sure will still happen. I mean, she just said, I'm not going anywhere, but that doesn't mean the divorce still won't go down. I'm pretty sure that Jacob's going to be um, asking his parents about this mystery to see what's going on. I mean, it is kind of interesting to think that they go from losing the church, which will eventually be torn down within what, like a week to possibly losing their home, which will possibly be torn down from the inside out. You know, if this mystery isn't solved. I mean, think of it this way. What if it comes down to Jacob and May getting booted out or going to prison or whatever the case may be due to the whole stipulations of the um, the uh, um, the deed to the house? And then it comes down to Charity, Grace and Jacob, you know, splitting the house. But then Carissa does something to try to usurp that either to get money, get bought out or whatever all for the sake of the house that she wants so she can move out. I think that Carissa, man, shoot. What, Charity played a huge role in the Green Leafs losing the church. Carissa's probably going to play a major role in them losing the house. And Grace is trying to hold things together as best she can, but I don't know, guys. This, this is getting real. I mean, the back half of season four is going to be something else. All I have to say is, I can't wait to get Bishop's response. Not, you know, May is going to be ready to kick some ass. I mean, uh, but I think I'm ready to see what Bishop has to say when Jacob brings this up to him. And and I think it's a dark twist how Carissa wanted Jacob to talk with May, basically um, to talk with his parents about who will get the house in their will. But now on the flip side, Carissa has information on the deed slash will. And Jacob's going to have to talk with his parents about what's going on about the house. So writers, that was a good twist. I like that. So um, I don't, I mean, gosh, I don't know what to say. I don't even know what to say. I mean, to think that Carissa had to go through all this to get chlamydia in order to get what she wanted to find out about the house. <laughs> Oh, crap. All right. Well, let me know what you think. Do you think Carissa is going to be the charity of the house situation? Like, again, charity was the, the the secret spy that led to the Greenleaves losing the church. Carissa might be the secret spy who's going to lead to um, the Greenleaves losing their home. And remember, Fernando works for H&H, &H, so who knows what he's going to do with this information as well. We'll just have to wait and see. I mean, it's one thing to kick the green leaves out of the church, but to actually go so far as to get them out of this town in their house, we'll just have to wait and see how it plays out. So, you know the drill. Make sure you subscribe. Hit me up on social media. Donate via Cash App or PayPal if you, you know, have a couple bucks you would like to uh, send my way. Not mandatory, but at the very least, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, and I will talk to you in the next video.